go. All right, so we're almost done with our, our bath with Jack. And um, he's got a lot of things that we're kind of concerned about. Um, but also some things that are, are looking better. You know, all of this, it looks like his fur is starting to, to kind of replenish and look a little more healthy, but he doesn't have a lot of it. And um, all of his epidermis, maybe just a lot of the top layer of his skin is coming off all over his hips, all over his underbelly. So we're trying to get as much of it off of him as possible and just lightly kind of debride the area so that it'll come up. And there's just tons of skin coming up, tons and tons of skin coming up. Um, you can see the one of the other things that's concerning, he's got a big boil on his head right here that we're gonna need to have lanced and checked out. And uh, his head just doesn't look very good. It's very swollen, his eyes are really swollen, and um, he's got a lot of, he's just gotta be in a lot of, a lot, a lot of pain, a lot of discomfort. So today at the veterinary hospital, we're gonna try and get him as much of a um, proper diagnosis as possible. We've had a lot of, there's been a lot of veterinary work on him, but nothing, uh, no final, um, you know, no final determination as to what exactly is wrong with him other than a lot of allergies, but he's got to have a problem other than just allergies to be, to be this sick. So if we need to take him to a dermatologist, um, you know, we will, if we need to get him wherever he needs to go, we'll get him. It's just, I'm afraid it's going to be more of an uphill battle than I thought. But um, yeah, we may get a uh, fundraiser together and put it together for him so we can take him to a special dermatologist.